Hey guys, Luke Clausen here. You know, we're out fishing in the main river right now. It's a channel bank, big laydowns coming off. It's a deep water. It's kind of a winter time pattern, really early spring. But at the same time, there's fish spawning here right now. And that's one thing in the springtime, if there was a tip to give you, it's that not all fish do everything at once. They don't all spawn at once. There are some fish that are still out that feel like it's winter. That water down below is still really cold, even though we've had some warm days here. So not all fish are doing the same thing at any one given time. We're on a lake right now where there's a lot of pressure up shallow because there are a few fish moving up. But really still, some of the best fishing is out. A lot of the fish that haven't went there yet, those fish, when they get done spawning, there'll still be a whole nother wave of fish. These fish sit there in some slow progression. It's mother nature's way of protecting these fish. If they all went and did the same thing at one time, the spawn could be completely diminished. But different parts of the lake, they do stuff differently. But even in the same section of the lake, there will be fish way out when they're way in. So when you're fishing in the spring, you don't think because it's warm, we need to go to the bank and catch those fish. They are some of the easiest fish to catch, but that's not your only option get out on these channel swing banks or brush or rock out deeper where you'd catch them in the winter, there's still fish out there too. So there's a lot of options for the spring. Don't pigeonhole yourself thinking you gotta go fish shallow for the few fish that are up there. A lot of times fishing out, there's still more fish.